Hi, this is Paul again from Gravel Hill Lighting. Welcome to one of our how-to videos. Uh, this is uh, about the really, really easy way to strip back um, fabric covered uh, lighting cable. And uh, you will need a little investment in the right tools, but they're not expensive. And if you do a lot of wiring, um, they are well worth the purchase. We do sell them in our shop, um, gravelhill.lighting. And while I'm on the subject, um, just to remind you that we are suppliers of lighting components and complete lighting to trade and retail clients and we will supply worldwide. Okay, um, let's get on with it. Here's a bit of fabric covered lighting cable <clears throat> and here's a blade which you'll need one of these. Clearly be very careful when you use one of these. Uh, we cannot be held responsible for you cutting yourself. Uh, you do need to use it responsibly. So, to do the cable, um, what I suggest is if you go about 30 mil into the cable, very roughly, and rest the blade on that and very gently just twist it around so you put a light score all the way around the cable. This breaks the fabric cable and puts a little marker for this tool to uh, do its job. Um, this will strip the outer cable um, and all you do is simply place that uh, so the middle of this tool is where you've made your small incision. Uh, I do need to point out on this, when you make that incision it is important that you just do a very light score. Uh, do not press hard because if you do you can go through to the inner cable and if you've done that you'll need to scrap that section and start again. And anyway, just simply we squeeze and that's it, it's off, leaving your three wires, your earth, your neutral, and your live. Uh, we do suggest that you just wrap a little bit of fabric, uh, of insulating tape around there, just to stop the fabric uh, braiding from fraying, and then you've ended up with your three wires. Um, to strip those back, this tool is all that's required. Um, this will take various different thicknesses of wire. On this particular wire we're using the third groove, which is the one millimetre groove. Uh, again, I would leave about 10 millimetres of the inner flex exposed. So if you just move it there, position it in the middle, make sure it's stuck in, it's put into that uh, correct groove and then simply squeeze there we go. That has taken the outer cable off and left you with a very nice exposed uh, copper strand uh, to wire into your lamp holder or whatever it is you're wiring into. Um, we do sell these tools online. Uh, mine's a bit grubby. We do supply them brand new. Um, but if you're doing a lot of wiring, they will make things a lot easier. So I hope that's helped. Um, have a great day and thanks for watching.